Hello coolers and welcome back to Viva Barca, the home of everything Barcelona, where we are going to be discussing on some interesting updates. We start with this report from Sport, talking about Usman Dembele, as it has been reported that Dembele's camp have now opened the door for a possible January departure. We are going to be discussing much on that as we progress. Then secondly, we are going to be talking about this report claiming that Barcelona plan to renew three players once the winter transfer window closes. We are going to be discussing much on that as well. So guys, as we get ready to discuss those stories in much detail, please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed. Give this video a like and make sure to watch this video right up to the very end. Barca, Barca, Barca. According to recent reports from Sport, Usman Dembele has opened the door to a possible January departure. The player has not agreed to sign a new deal but sees he will not play for the club again and it's a situation that benefits nobody. The player met with Javi for two hours on Tuesday and his agents did the same with Vice President Rafa Yuster and the club's Director General Ferran Reveta a day later. So that was when the agents paid this report considered moving him before the winter window shuts down. The reason for their change of attitude is because Barcelona have not included him in their recent squad and it could hurt Dembele's World Cup 2022 hopes. Then moving on to the next story of discussion, Usman Dembele's contract renewal problems has made Barcelona extra cautious about the contracts that are expiring soon. Both Ansu Fati and Pedri were renewed for an additional 5 years and now they have 3 other players on their radar whose contract ends soon, Ronald Araujo, Gavi and Sergio Roberto. The goal of Juan Laporta and co is to jump on their renewals as soon as the winter transfer market closes, 1st February. Starting with Ronald Araujo, with his contract expiring in 2023, he is arguably one of Barcelona's most marketable players. He is a quick physical defender who has adapted to the ways of a modern centre-back with his ball-playing ability. He is also arguably Barcelona's best player this season and wants his new contract to reflect that. Consequently, he has reportedly rejected the first renewal offer to him because of a disparity in wage demands. There is said to be a solid relation you know, between Araujo and the club and a long-term renewal for him is inevitable. Then talking about Pablo Gavi, another player whose importance in the first team does not reflect his wages. At 17 years old, he has no plans to leave and is ready to accept any renewal offer presented to him. In the past, it has been said that Barcelona kept a part of their budget aside early on to renew the Spaniard and it will, it will see his release clause jump to 1 billion euros. Then lastly, talking about Sergio Roberto, the odd one out, Sergio Roberto as it stands is neither a starting 11 player nor young. His contract clocks up in the summer of this year and talks over his renewal have been going on since last year. So it seems however that the parties are clashing their heads over the salary. Barcelona want to slash a part of Roberto's salary in an attempt to reduce the salary cap and bring in more players. So coolers, with that we come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't, please make sure to do so so you always stay up to date with the latest on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time, bye bye.